Hey, good morning. It's Nick Germano from Inflatable 5K. How's it going? Hey! Hey, we we heard a rumor yesterday, Nick, and I know that you can clear this up for us. We heard that this year at the Insane Inflatables uh, from Anika Federal Credit Union, uh, that we're going to have 14 inflatables, and 10 of those are going to be brand new, weren't here last year. We're actually going to have 11 inflatables. Um, We carry 11 inflatables to every event. Okay, now but we are going to have a, a, a number of inflatables this year that we didn't have last year, new to the area. Oh, absolutely we are. We did bring back some of our signature obstacles from last year, uh, such as our uh, jump around obstacle, our mattress run, and then um, we kind of revamped and, and reimagined some of our obstacles from last year and also brought in some brand new obstacles for the event. So it's, it's going to be a lot of fun. And <laughs> Nick, I got it. I got to ask, these parties where you guys, you know, come up with, when you say you revamped and rethought some of the uh, inflate, when the, these parties where y'all y'all get together, is there a lot of alcohol involved at those parties where, <laughs> where it's like, you know, what we really ought to do is have them slide down a 150-foot slide? One would think. One would think there was. And, and you know, that's actually how Insane Inflatable was formed. And it was, it was over a couple of drinks at a bar, jotting some ideas down on a napkin. But since then, we kind of streamlined the process, and we all kind of get together and talk about what works and what doesn't. And we definitely listen to the feedback of the people who have run the race before. And, um, you know, I think we've come up with some pretty pretty awesome obstacles for, for our participants. We're going to be back on the campus of LSUS this year. We're going to have trunk or treating, courtesy of Yoakum Toyota, prior to uh, Insane Inflatables this year. Right there, uh, you can bring the kids, and we'll have a number of vehicles out there. And and people because it's going to be on Halloween that this is taking Absolutely. place, so people can actually come and and get candy for the kids from the trunks mm-hmm. of these cars. You know where it's a really safe environment, and uh, wow. then you can go run it all off. Right, and make Absolutely. the make the kids run too. That's <laughs> right. That's right. You know, get them good and tired. The exercise. Um, is there is there a, 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 an age that you would say, hey, you know, you really want the kids to be at least what age? Uh, we we don't have an age. It's it's a height, um, and we require the children to be forty two inches. Um, with that being said, you know, we are open to. Kids and parents and people of all ages, all ability levels, we are a fun run. We're not a time run. So yeah. um, you don't really have to worry about being a, a triathlon star. You can go out there. You can walk that whole course and really just spend some time on the obstacles and enjoy them. I still have my medal from last year. Do you right? really? Yeah, it's hanging in my bathroom. You know, I can't believe you made it through that. I did. I did. did you skip any obstacles? Who may cheat? No. At, at the insane inflatable It's not water. a timed event. It's all good. <laughs> You know what? Yeah, make, make sure you grab your medal this year. We got a, a new medal this year, so. It's oh, that's sharp. awesome! Now you know what? Uh, one of the things that a lot of people were talking about last year was just how cool it is hanging around the finish line because the guy that comes out and does all the announcing and it's just a that's a huge party like mm-hmm. environment right there at the finish line. Oh, for sure. There's so much energy at that finish line, and everyone's just super excited to. Um, go down that final slide and, and get their T-shirt, get their medal, and see their friends and family who've been waiting for them to, to finish the race. So it is quite the accomplishment. I you know I, I want to remind people that it is a 5K race, so there is some challenge involved with it, but it's it's the most fun you'll ever have running a 5K, and that's, that's a fact. Okay. Well, awesome, awesome stuff. Hop on it now. We've got all the information, a link to get registered, everything at MyKissCountry937.com. Nick, thank you, brother. My pleasure. Thanks for having me on this morning.